So the next box that I want to review is the Boxy Charm box. This guy right over here. This is the first beauty box that I did a yearly subscription to and I saw a lot of unboxings of this box online and I thought it was a really good deal. It's $21 a month and you get four to five full size products and the average of every product in there is about $20. So you just really need to like at least one thing in the box and the box is paid for. So I think that's a great deal and that's a big reason why I got the your subscription to it. This is the May box and it says Hello Charmer right as you open it. And then there's a list of the products and how much all of the products are, which I appreciate that because that's a good way of telling if it was worth the money. And I, the year subscription I think is like $234 because they uh, charge you for 11 boxes instead of 12, so you get like one box free. Which is great. Yeah, just a list of all the items and how much they are, and then on the back it says something about, you know, going on their Twitter, their Instagram, and charming. And charming and tagging three of your charming besties. <laughs> That's cute. That's real cute. The first thing that I notice is this eyebrow pencil. So it says brow right over there, right in the middle. And on the back it says Body Graph Pro. So at the end it's angled. Cool, and then on this end, it's the spoolie side, which I have a brow pencil because I fill in my brows. Like, I try to do, like, that fade. I use Anastasia, uh, but, uh, yeah, no, like, I'll definitely, like, use this as well. So that's pretty cool, and I think this is, I think, 19 or $20. Let's see. Uh, yeah, $19 just for this, so that's pretty good. And... It's $21 a month, including the shipping and handling, which is awesome. This Lauren Beauty Beverly Hills Nail Couture Pink Nail Polish. It says it doesn't have any formaldehyde, DBP, Tuline. It's cruelty-free, and it's vegan-friendly. You can get this at laurenbeauty.com, so that's pretty cool. And it's like this cool, like, pinkish-reddish color. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like it. Yeah, and this is, you know, all the products in here are full size, and it's $18. There's so many beauty boxes out there, and the products are just, like, literally, like, that big. You get, like, this much, and it's just like, all right, well, I'll use it once, and I won't even know if <laughs> I like it. Like, I just, yeah, it's pointless. And then, in this little bag, it says the lip bar. Well, what is going on here? It's in the color Purple Rain. This is like art right here. Miniature lantern, like you would just put like a light in there and illuminate like your backyard or like a walkway or something. It has a little lipstick. I could probably do that right now with the lips that I have on right now. Um, and it's in this cool purple color, whoa. That's pretty awesome. And look at this like casing. <laughs> I feel like you'd get this at like Pottery Barn or something. All right, so let's take a look at this bad boy. Whoa. Yep. Pigmented. That's a beautiful yeah. purple color. Oh, that's pretty cool. That is pretty nice. Yeah, that's a fun color. And their whole theme of this box is like, bold, be bold and beautiful. Or bold is beautiful or whatever. Bold and beautiful. Yeah, that's very cool. I like that. And, this, and that was... $20. $20 right here. I can just put it right back here. You know, if I'm traveling, I can put this right in here. Ooh. Cool. And then this is just the inside of the box. This is the last. These are the last two items. It's in bubble wrap. So right over here, it says, okay, Bodyography, again, Brow Trio. So this goes with the eyebrow pencil that they put in there. So that's pretty cool. Uh, expressions can be used as blush, eyeshadow, eyeliner, or to fill in the brow. Whoa, that's cool. So it does all of those things. Let me just get this out of this little 
Okay, so this is the little container it comes in. It says essential. Okay, so this is probably like a basic one of this. Okay, and that's those are the colors. So I see like the taupe and the dark brown and then like the regular brown. The lighter brown, yeah, so you can use this. Even as an eyeshadow. Oh, cool. There's a blush. Wow, that's pretty cool. That's awesome. Maybe even as a bronzer. It doesn't say that, but I just like threw that in there. I don't know why I smell new things. It just smells new. I'll try some of like. Whoa. Pigmented. Yes, that's the brown. That's the dark brown. Wow, like. The powder just falls off. I don't really like that. <laughs> but I'm sure the color, but it goes like. Let's, there's the brown right next to it. And then, whoa. The tan. Right there. Can use that as a highlight. Yeah, it's super pigmented. <laughs> Excited. Put this back. Okay, and then the last thing is from Model Co. And it's a bronzer. <laughs> Can cut that the Model Co out. bronze. Shimmer bronzing powder 01 for face and for body. Ooh, I want to bronze my body. So just sweep a light dusting over face, neck, and Decolletage. Okay, and this is what it looks like. Okay, so it's gold and it's shimmery. Cool. Let's do a swatch. Can you see that? I can't even see that. It's like right here. Nope, I can't see it. It's sh There we go. Yeah, there you see it. If I put it on my face, you can see it. It's like the same shade as like my wrist. I can see it right here, yeah. It's like a little bit. I'll brush right it right into here. like like my cheeks, like right over here, underneath like my jawline right over here. Maybe like around my face, like around my temples and stuff. I could even use it, you know, as like a contour as well. Could shimmer up like decolletage. Yes, 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 yes. So Model Co. Bronze Shimmer, $22. Yeah, that's a really good deal, I think. I'm really glad I got a year subscription and I'll probably get another year subscription next year as well. It seems like BoxyCharm never lets anybody down, which I love that. Makes me feel like I can trust the integrity of the company to the point where I know it's just a good idea to invest in something like this. And it is an investment because what if what if you get a year subscription to a beauty box that like starts sucking after like a few months? Like I don't think that's gonna happen with BoxyCharm because I've just seen so many reviews from like this year, from last year, from the year before that. And it all just like looks really good. It always looks really good. But yeah, it's the boxy.